This tutorial shows how to integrate Groovy with Talent Open Studio. Groovy is a flexible scripting language that brings all of the power of Java to bear. You can use any standard Java library or third party library uh, within your Talent Open Studio job. I'll start off by creating a job called Groovy Test, and I'll add a single component called T Groovy. T Groovy's got a box where you can enter your script code. Offline, I've got a script here. I'm going to paste it into this text box. Now this particular script is going to create a file and the file is going to get the contents of a directory. So this might be the type of script you'd run before processing to see what's in your, your input before you actually start anything. I'd also like this groovy script to take certain parameters from the overall talent job. And the way that you do this is through this variables screen here. I'll first add a context, and I have something called Scratch Jobs Context Group. And Scratch Jobs Context Group has three variables data dir, report dir, and processing report file name. These are going to correspond to the three variables that I'll define in this component configuration, and these are three variables that are used in the Groovy script. They're called data dir, report dir, and processing. file name. Because I've added the context, I can use code complete, control, spacebar, and I can select the variables without having to remember or refer back to some other screen. Okay. So I've got my three variables defined, I have my script defined, and I'm going to run it. It runs successfully. Take a look at the output. And you can see it's containing a list of the files. I put some header information. Uh, this is an actual name of an HTML file. Uh, this is a folder up here. Now, an alternative is if you've got a lot of Groovy scripts, you might be building up a library. You can also use the T Groovy file component. Similar process in the job, I'm going to add the context, and I'm also going to add the three variables that are referred to in the script. Rather than adding the code to a panel, I'm going to use a um, use a file, so I don't need to cut and paste and run the job. Okay, same results, and it'd be the same output file. Now, because I ran it a little later, it's going to have a different timestamp. So it's pretty easy to run Groovy scripts. Uh, it's a very flexible language, um, and any time you can't do anything um, easy or maybe you want to have fewer components in your job, call up a Groovy script.